When the Grob ship appeared in the Earth's atmosphere, humanity did what they always do in the face of the unknown. They feared and attacked. Due to their language being vastly different from what we understand language to be, we weren't able to communicate and couldn't comprehend their motives. For 10 years, their ship simply hovered over our Earth's atmosphere while scientists and linguists worked day and night to overcome the communication barrier. Meanwhile, in the shadows, others worked to rid our planet of what they dubbed the alien menace. One man in particular, Eli Johnson, got a hold of some alien DNA and created a pathogen to eliminate them. It worked a little too well. Not only did it wipe out most of the aliens, but it also took down 85% of the Earth's human population as well. What we didn't understand was these aliens were cedars. They were the ones responsible for life on Earth in the first place. Our DNA was directly tied to theirs. You see, about a month ago, the remaining grobs and humans finally broke through the language barrier and they were able to explain all of this to us. They weren't here to attack us. They were here simply to see how far their children had come, to see if we were ready to take our place in the stars. I guess we weren't. I've been tasked to acquire a piece of alien tech from one of the ships that crashed on the planet and go back in time and kill Eli Johnson before he created the virus that would lead us all to ruin. The real question is, can I do it? Can I kill this man in cold blood? Can I murder my own son? <laughs>